All right. Week four. This was Tuesday, 9-19. We're talking about scaling. <clears throat> so here are the topics. Some more about spanning tree. And per VLAN spanning tree, wrap it. Then we did some multi-layer switching work too. Okay. We started a lab on that. We reviewed a th few things. We um, spanning tree bridge protocol data units, and we looked at an example here. PCs. <clears throat> talked about development of the red bridge and so forth. <clears throat> we did some review. We tried to define, you know, we're talking about production, the user, traffic and data. And we talked about protocol data, being able to distinguish between the two. We used the example of RIP, talk a little bit about ACLs, RIP version 2 between the routers. <clears throat> Took a look at the um, numbers. <clears throat> That's a 9, this is an 8, which is, you know, they take the middle here, <clears throat> right in between here. To identify that root bridge, the extra one there. See, I can clarify that. That's that's that VLAN one plus one onto the eight. <clears throat> Get that number for the root bridge, <clears throat> right? It's um. Default numbers plus max, so you four bits, twelve bits, and then the MAC address to identify the road bridge. <coughs> so we went through, talked about that in class. <coughs> we um we were working on this lab. It took us a while, but we finally got it all to work. Initially, I said they should put a PC on a multi-layered switch, communicates the router, and then the router, I was giving them an address that eventually got to um, the network here on campus. And, of course, once you get in that network, that network allowed you to get out to the Internet. <clears throat> and then the goal was to add a couple switches, layer two switches, and then have this information, you know, filter down everything from your VLANs and so forth. Filter down, you can put some ports on different VLANs here. So it was really a review of everything we've learned. We had the work we did inside the multi layer switch. They were to do DHCP. Here they had to do NAT. We want to be able to have a server down here, up here, and so forth. <clears throat> and this was the next week, so that Thursday we worked on that lab. So that's it.